and more state governors are also unveiling measures to cushion the impact of few stops to removal on citizens. Here in Lagos, Governor Babajide Soulu has announced a reduction in public transport fares by 50%. The governor says the reduction will commence from August the 2nd, 2023, while talks are, well, this has been confirmed that the private transport sector uh, to slash fares by 25%. We understand the Danfo buses, the yellow ones. Governor was speaking with newsmen shortly after a council meeting with security officials, including the commissioner of police who briefed the council on the success of a special operation codenamed Operation Flush. Immediately from Wednesday, uh, all public transportation that are being controlled by Lamata, um, all of the high capacity buses will be plying all the routes of Lagos at a 50% discount. Um, all the commuters that will be plying on this route will start enjoying a 50% rebate on the current um, uh, transport fare that are currently being charged on all of these buses and this will start um, immediately from Wednesday. For the um, informal um, um, buses, they are also going to make um, a pronouncement today and if I dare, I mean, can, can say to you that we've also agreed with them that they will be doing about 25% reduction, you know, on their on their buses, all of the yellow buses, you know, that we have on the streets, you know, they will also make a formal a formal announcement maybe later today on that. So that probably could take effect from tomorrow or latest on Wednesday, you know, as I, as I mentioned. And the other means of of relief that we will be passing on is we've also concluded. Uh, discussions with our various stakeholders um, will be passing um, once the concluded arrangements are in place, you know, foodstuffs to the very vulnerable in our society, um, the poorest of the poor, will be using interventions with um, various stakeholders, civil society groups, um, CDCs and CDAs, uh, various churches and mosques. Um, our traditional rulers, um, our local government, and so we will send around um, daily foodstuff, rice, beans, gari, and all of the things that can cushion the effects you know, of the current hardship that we have in the state.